Hello everyone. In this video we are gonna see how to compute linear convolution using C6748 processor. Before that let's see what is linear convolution. It is a basic operation to calculate output for any linear time invariant system given its input and impulse response. Here the input is given as x of n and impulse response is given as h of n. With these two the output is calculated and it is denoted as y of n. The linear convolution is quite often used as a method of implementing filters of various types. Now let's see what is the procedure in PC to compute this using processor. Firstly double click the CC setup studio. Go to file menu and click import. Now select browse. And give file type as all files. And for file name just type as C6748. Click open. And select OK. Now the C6748 processor board is imported. Then select save and quit. It is asking whether to start the code composer studio on exit click S. The Code Composer Studio software is opened. Here go to Project menu and click New. We have to create a new project so we have to change the target. Select the target ending with 67xx and for project name we can give anything we want. Now I am giving as Priya123 and select Finish. Next go to file menu, click new and then select source file. A new file will be opened. Here only we gonna paste the source program. For that go to local folders and open recovery image D folder. Go to VSK6748 software folder. And open linear convolution folder. Here open the C file for linear convolution. Copy the full program and paste it here. Next go to file menu and click save as. Here go to my projects and open our project folder which we named as Priya123. In this folder save our source file with an extension .c that is as Priya123.c and click save. Furthermore, we need to add some files to our project. So again open the local folder and copy the link a DSP file from where we copied the source program. Now here go to project menu and click add files to project. Here give file type as all files and then paste the link a DSP file here. Now we should select two files that is the link a DSP file and the C file and click open. Now we have to rebuild the program. So go to project menu and click rebuild all. It will display whether our program has any errors or not. We got zero errors here. So next go to debug menu and click connect to connect the kit. Here we got halted that means our target is connected successfully. A disassembly window is also popped up. Next go to file menu and click load the program. Here go to debug and our file name should be with an extension dot out. Click save. Now the program has been loaded. Go to view menu and select memory. Here only we need to paste the input and output address to view the output. Change this into 32 bit unsigned integer. First copy the address of x of n and paste it here. Now I am gonna give the first data as 2, second data as 3, third data as 4 and the fourth data as 5. Then copy the memory address of h of n. 
and paste this here. For this I am giving the first data as 1, second data as 2, third data as 3, and the fourth data as 4. Next copy the memory address of x of n length. And paste here. The number of datas we gave for x of n is 4. So I am giving here as 4. Next copy the address of h of n length. And paste here. For h of n also we gave 4 datas. So I am giving as 4 for this too. And at last copy the address of output. And paste this to here. Now go to debug and run the program. The output has been displayed. Here we got length of the output as 7 and the datas are 2, 7, 16, 30, 34, 31 and 20. Now let's cross check the output with a theoretical calculation. Here too we got the same output. And that's it. We have executed linear convolution using a TMS320C6748 processor.